You are watching SGTV, socially good television. The name of this game is the Thanks for Giving All-Star Game. Uh, represents all of the Summit County schools that are no longer in playoff contention. So anybody that's playing this event uh, has been eliminated from playoff contention. And the whole purpose of this event is for these young men to get another opportunity to showcase their talents and in front of uh, a lot of different scouts from the area and uh, some of those outside of the area. And it also gives uh, the community a chance. We sponsor a camp food drive that uh, the Native American Culture Center actually feeds people on Thanksgiving Day. And uh, not only that, but we also make a cash donation to the Akron Canton Food Bank as well. It's something special that no one really understands. I was just talking with a parent who's from the Cleveland area that their child's playing in, and they didn't understand it. And when I broke it down to them and told them, and I gave them the history that we, we, we really delved into, and going back from the, you know, from the 40s, starting with the Thanksgiving Day game with the City Series to now, they walked away, I think, awestruck. They, they, they couldn't believe how special this it was and how the community really rallies around for this game and just how great it is for these kids to be able to play in this. When these kids get older, they're going to realize what a brotherhood, a fraternity this is and how special it is uh, to basically, unless you're still playing in the playoffs, to have the entire county to come up and watch you play, some for the last game ever in their career, but some, they're going to still continue going on, but they'll never forget this. Uh, all in all, uh, Akron has a great background, a great history. This game started in 1942 and ran through 1990 uh, before the Ohio High School playoffs kind of put an ending to it. Uh, our goal was to revive it and put it back in the Akron community, make it part of Thanksgiving morning where uh, people would attend the game and then go home and enjoy their turkey and uh, the rest of the day celebrating a football event. But uh, we're very thankful for the supporters and those that uh, have uh, got behind us with this event and we only hope to make it grow here in the future. You know this week is a Thanksgiving week so it's kind of a holiday season they all come together as one and uh, you know you overhear some of the kids talking about the stories during the season and the, and the respect that they have for one another and their teams and I think when you just you know kind of put that all together it makes for a special event. Uh, the kids that I've seen over the last four years and I've pretty much seen every team that's come through uh, they're good character kids you know good in the classroom uh, good outside the classroom and uh, I think they take a, lo a good lo hard look at that and I know the, uh, the coaches in the area take a good hard look at that and uh, you know if you can have it both as in character and in athletics and of course academics uh, I think that would help you a lot of these guys are uh, on, a, on the tier or on the cusp of getting a college scholarship coaches are looking at them and they, it's their last time for them to shine a lot of them uh, didn't make it to the uh, playoffs so this is their playoff game and uh, there's a rivalry east against west and they really get up for it. So for me, I get up for it as well. A lot of kids are going to be watching this game. You want to practice hard at all times, like the kids that are playing here. They're all here for a reason. They didn't. They weren't. They're not here by uh, any chance of luck, or they're here because of their skill. And each one of these players worked hard to be here. Well, what I get out of the game, it's pretty simple for me. It's gratitude. Uh, and I just feel the more I give, the more I'm going to get. And if I can help a kid or I can help another coach or help another person, uh, I'm very excited to, to do that. And uh, uh, I, I've learned over time that it's not about what you do, it's about what you give and how you help people, whether they're on the football field or off the football field. And uh, that's very important to me in my life.
Thank you for watching SGTV, Socially Good Television. Visit sociallygoodtv.com and remember to share this video.